Hey everybody, welcome back to my blind playthrough of Silent Hill Downpour, episode 2. Thank you all so much for being here and for clicking on this video. I am so excited to keep going and I hope you all are doing great. So, a couple of things before we get started. I'm going to adjust the brightness settings. <laughs> uh, I'm in agreement with some of you. I think that it is maybe a little dark. And it doesn't help that I have this bright light in my face, but that's inevitable. You know, you gotta get the lighting. So, I think it would probably benefit me to probably adjust that. Alright, alright, let's turn it up quite a bit. How's this? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this looks better, doesn't it? Also, if you have any uh, tips on getting the 60 FPS, that would be great because it's like I don't notice really what I'm playing, but when I'm editing, I'm like, good lord, it was chugging in so many areas that I just wasn't really noticing uh but if you have any tips on that for the xenia canary patch let me know and last thing i wanted to say it was so refreshing to see how passionate you guys were about this game you know like a lot of you were saying i don't care what anyone says i love this game and i think that is awesome because there are a couple of games that are underdogs that i totally ship like tomb raider legend they say that one's probably one of the not as strong ones, but I have so much nostalgia and love for that game. So no one could ever tell me it's not good, <laughs> you know? So it's always great to see when you when you stick up for it, you know? All right, so since I haven't been here in a while. Ah, let me just get my motor skills back. You know, maybe I should turn off my light, maybe. Maybe. We'll see how it goes. All right, let's get going. Sheesh. So the underground river powers most of the mine's machinery. Hmm. Interesting. When elevator machinery, when the Gillespie... Hmm, look at that. Gillespie Coal and Iron Company established the Devil's Pit Mine in 1816. Electric power was not invented yet. As the mining operation expanded and dug deeper into the earth, Hauling ore and equipment and men to the surface via man and animal power became impractical. A new system was needed. The miners began to use power of the underground river in Devil's Falls to power simple machinery like water wheels for hoisting ore to the surface on pulley systems. As the operations grew more complex and ambitious, so too did the machinery. By the mid 19th century, Devil's Pit utilized one of the most sophisticated and earliest adapt or applications of hydroelectric power. This elevator was one of the first of its kind, using an engine ingenious system of gears and water wheels to take men and equipment to the upper caverns. Nice. Okay. So, in order to get in here, we're going to need to get that on. I, I gather, I wager. And there was nothing here? Ah, staircase. Yeah, see, it is pitch black for me right now. Just on my monitor. I think my monitor's just dark. More reading. Water chute. This collection of water wheels, cogs, gears, and troughs was used to transfer the natural power of the underground river to various mechanical systems. This was the engineer's control hub, which allowed them to redirect the water's flow via a series of wooden troughs, which in turn powered various mechanical devices such as the main elevator, a flood control pump, and even an early electrical generator. This device was restored to its original working condition by the Silent Hill Pre-Historic Preservation Society. Hey, we know that place. Nightmare fuel. Alright, looks like we got a series of puzzles here. Would not expect otherwise. Okay. Looks like a little visual map system. Ah. Wonder what the water pump's for. Wonder what the water pump's for. I have a feeling I'm supposed to keep this. Can I make it go any other direction? Can't make it go up or down. Hmm. Alright, let's leave it there. Just want to try something first. Ah. Ah, I see. We need to connect them. This one goes forward, but now it's in the way. 
Oh, maybe that works. Maybe that works. Must have drained the cave. Maybe that works. That looks like that works. Yeah. I mean, it's flowing over here. Yep, so it drained the cave. Got it. So there we go. We're powering the pumps. Damn it. I gotta prop this open somehow. Prop this open. Let me check out the rest. Hmm, maybe maybe we need to get the elevator working then because okay. So we need to prop this open somehow. I think that's what he's saying. Uh, obviously that's what he said. But maybe then we move these around a bit to power the elevator, I suppose. I don't know if there's any other way of doing this. You know what I mean? Like, what other way of flowing the water is there? Well, that answers our question. We cannot move that one. Ah, that's what it was. Okay. Okay. So now we're powering the elevator. Let's see. Over that will be. Oh, down below. Oh, but we have to get this propped open somehow, he said. If I see all this wood here. I feel like we would be able to do that. Okay, what about this? No. Just checking, just checking. I don't really know what I'm doing here. We could maybe flow the water left, right? Like the way we had it? So let's do this. One more. How's that? Now it's doing nothing. Okay. And then do this. Uh, what about the other way? There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, got it. Now this is open again. So how can we prop this open, as he says? How could we do that? Anything we can push? Ah! There we go! Problem solved! Physics puzzles. Alright, you stay right there. How's that? That look nice? Okay. Now, I put my brain cells together. It took me a minute, but um... Now, all we need to do is get this aligned. Grab that water. There we go. One more. Um... Okay, that's the pumps, so one more left. I don't think we need the pumps. We already did the pumps. We drained. So now, elevator works. Hey, let's go! God, it's dark. It really is dark. Alright, we should be good. Boom bada boom! I miss my flashlight. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to say, turn it up! Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh oh. Shoot! Jesus, take the wheel! Something was in there. Okay, great. 
we're here with our wee little ladder. All right, check for items. Huh. No, I used my. We're back. Hmm. I miss my flashlight so bad. Get away from me. Yeah, for real. Do I have to fight her? I do. Hey, I'm blocked. Hey, I'm blocking that. Alright. Where's my pickaxe? Oh, I was trying to dodge. Okay, I tried pulling out the pickaxe, but I don't think I have it anymore. Ow. About to go get that rock. No! You can't put your back to them. Alright, give me this rock. No! No. The camera work is odd. But, you know, we're dealing. Dude, she's kicking my rear end! Great, she's paralyzing me with her... Screams. Oh, she's kind of blue. You. Her face. Ow, that last one I didn't block. Holy crap. Dude. And does it help that they're so freaking fast? You come on. Oh, Jesus. I'm trying to get out in the open so I can make sure I don't have that pickaxe anymore. No, dude, you can't. Nope, I don't. I don't have it. Shake. Dude, this lady is gonna kill me. God, is this a boss fight or what? Jesus Christ! Let's do this again. Is there- Oh my god. God save the queen. I found a hammer. Yeah, for real. See? You can't really block when you have just a rock, I see. Dude. These are the most- Oh, it's bro- it's broken already. Are you kidding me? Oh, wait, you're not gonna do nothing now? Ah, oh, this is the worst. Any other weapons? God dang it, dude. This is not fun. Ay, 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 ay. I'm looking for another weapon. There has got to be another one. Other than a rock. Where'd it go? My god. Finally! Holy crap! That was just so bad. <sighs> what do we got here? Train tour of the mines. In the early years, as I was pet, mine carts were used transportation. Duh, duh, duh. 
do to spur inclines to climb to fit tunnels. It was unavoidable that the tracks would have sharp hazards, often deadly turns. Jeez. Avoid riding aboard the carts whenever possible. Oh my god. Death rate is 40%. 4 out of 10 miners who hitched a ride aboard a minecart met an unfortunate end. Dude, I apologize. That was just... I... Ah, here we go. Oh, the frame drops are getting pretty bad. No! Stop it. Oh my god, dude. Okay, let me make sure there's nothing through here. That I needed. I don't think so. It's me and my rock. And little girl noises. Train accident at Devil's Pit causes death of eight children. Oh. That makes a lot of sense as to what we're hearing. In what Silent Hill law enforcement officials are calling an unprecedented tra tragedy, eight children were killed last night when the tour train in which they were riding derailed in the Devil's Pit mines. Witnesses claim that J.P. Sater Oh, the train's operator was visibly intoxicated at the time of the accident and that the negligence on his part may have led. Oh, man, the train guy was drunk, said Philip Minton, a tourist from Chicago. He was belligerent to everyone, even the kids. There was no way he should have been operating anything. We've just begun investigating this terrible accident. It's far too soon to speculate on anything. Detective Edward Rogers told a reporter this morning. Rest assured, we will utilize all available police resources and personnel to uncover the cause. The Silent Hill Tourism Authority has shut down all Devil's Pit operations indefinitely and has released the following statement. We are saddened by the horrific accident involving the tourist train at our facilities and we pledge to fully cooperate with law enforcement officials in all aspects. Wow. That is very realistic. That's the guy I met outside. Yes, it is. That was a really realistic report, like the way that was written. That is exactly what would happen. Oy! What is that? Oh my god, that actually scared me. I had to hide in the menu. What is this? Oh, sheesh. What is that? Are they just dummies? I do not like this at all. Dude, I'm scared right now. Please. Please don't come for me. Please. <laughs> I'm so... What was that? Oh my god, I only have a rock. Please! Give me, give me this, give me this. No. Well, yes. But, oh, I thought that was like a board or something. What are these? Are they just dummies, I guess? Oh, one fell over. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, we heal. We need it. I don't like this. Y'all better stay right there, I swear to god. I swear to god, I'm coming up to check on y'all. <gasps> oh my god! What was that? Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, it's like Dark Souls. Uh oh. Run, run. You? Why don't you come down here? Yeah, come here. I'll beat you with a stick. I will, I will. 
All right. Yeah. Come here. Oh. Okay. That sort of worked out. Yeah. Take that. Give me. No. Give me this. Uh-huh. Later, sucker. Later, sucker. Do your little jump thing. Yeah. How about that? <laughs> you got any more bottles for me somewhere? <gasps> is that a pickaxe? Ow! It is a pickaxe. Let's go. Come on. Ah. Uh, I was aiming at it. I'm about to... I'm about to smash this thing. Let's go! I can block real good now. Come on over here. Come on, drop down. <gasps> did he just block me? I think he did. He is almost dead. Look, he's all bloody. Come on, you freaking scary monster. What is he? Maybe I have to get his back? Oh, let's go! Lordy. A little sloppy. I'm... I'm aware. I'm, today's not my day. I, I'm a little off today. But you know what? It... It's okay. Gotta clean it up now. Whew. That was a scary monster. The build up to that was really cool. Sheesh, you really gotta hack this thing down. I want to get fresh air. I don't like being down here. Especially without a flashlight. That I could just clip. Oh my god. Devil's Falls. Did I read this already? I know we're in a new area, but... Breathtaking waterfall before you is Devil's Falls. As the second highest continually flowing single drop waterfall in North America, it plunges 14, well, 14, 19 feet to the subterranean river below. During the spring runoff, the Devil's Falls flow at a rate of 300 cubic feet per second. That's 2,400 gall gallons every second. The Devil's Falls feed an underground river system that flows through the 20 miles of limestone caverns until they empty into the nearby Toluca Lake. The Gillespie Coal and Iron Company put the power of Devil's Falls and the Underground River to good use, following the flowing water, using the flowing water to power various mining systems. Nice. Alright, I guess we're just going. We powered the elevator, so... Lordy. This game has thrown me off for sure. The fighting, the combat style, the mechanics, the button layout, everything. I'm waiting to see like a face pop up through one of these. Oh thank god. Oh thank god. We're here. We made it. Oh. Uh oh. Sider! Oh. It's just you. What are you doing, JP? Don't do it, bud. Uh, you know. Enjoying the view. You know, they say if you were to put the Empire State Building in here, it wouldn't even reach halfway to the top of this place. Seems like a dangerous place to be sightseeing. You know, none of those things they said about me are true. The papers and stuff, people around town, my lawyers, they said it was just... circumstantial evidence and whatnot. That's what I kept telling them. Yeah. I read all about it. Those newspaper men are damn liars.
spiders. Relax, man. We're just, we're just talking here. What happened? That was an accident. I didn't mean to hurt nobody. I didn't murder nobody. Murder's a mortal sin. You go to hell for murder. Ain't that right, Murphy? Surely your mama taught you about what's oh. right and what's wrong. Those kids had parents that might disagree with you. The paper mentioned negligence. It was an accident. You were completely hammered. There were witnesses. Murphy's getting and all up in you, this Murphy? business. Someone know all your dirty little secrets? <gasps> I want to know. Anybody that didn't deserve it. And I sure as hell never hurt any kids. I wouldn't be able to live with myself. <laughs> she call this living? Can you imagine what that's like, Murphy? Living all your life inside someone else's life? Can you? <laughs> Listen to us talk. As if anybody out there gives a damn. When we're the ones who decide if we can live with what we've done. Console. Wait. What do you mean? Just wait a second. Be seeing you around, Murphy. <gasps> no! He straight up did it. No hesitation. I was not expecting that. My god! Oh, we were on that side, right? I think so. Yeah, we were over there. Now we're on this side. Yeah, I, I think so. Oh my god, Murphy was getting all into it there for a second. I was like, whoa. I can't believe he jumped. He was straight up telling him, at least I didn't kill any kids. Hey, it's this wheelchair. Hmm. I need to heal soon, but kind of don't want to until I find another. Hey! Sweet. God, it, it's so... It is so dark. Yeah, here we go. Can go to the display. Look at that, I'm turning it up and it's not even getting- it's like barely getting brighter. Alright, I have to do it this way because uh, in the pure darkness like this, with my light shining in my face, I can't see- like, I can't see anything. And I know I have my flashlight, or lighter, but... Entry to the Cave of Tears. The dark cavern before you was originally called Deus Tusk Cavern. The cave contains the largest stalagmite in all northeastern America and was first discovered by Chinese immigrant miners in 1863. The Chinese miners believe that the great... Excuse me. The giant stalagmite to be a large tusk protruding from... D-U? Protruding from D-U which literally translate to Earth Prison in English, and is considered the realm of the dead in Chinese mythology, hence the name Deus Tusk. The cave is also the lifelong home to the weeping bat, a rare species of bat indigenous to the area. As a result, the cavern is often referred to by locals as the Cave of Tears. Wow. We're literally going to the realm of the dead according to what these Chinese miners believed due to that large stalagmite. Alright, well can't wait to see what, see what we have ahead here. Okay, I see, I see. Is the yellow dot where we are? Oh, yeah it is, it is. Holy crap. Wrap. And that's back where the diner is. I hope we can route back and go open that door. Um, one of you had commented that. Silent Hill Hillside. Keeping my weapon out because I ain't messing around. I'm trying to clean this playthrough up. And everybody remember, it's my first time playing it. 
So you know. Or something. Oi! I was listening to an informative educational. Now I can't read it, or I can't focus on it. Yeah, take that. Come on down here. Oh, I got you first. I got you first. Where'd you go? Come on over here. Uh huh. There you go. Run right into it. Run right into it. Oh, you almost dead. Take that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All you need is one more, I think. Interesting concept that they can crawl on the ceiling. Oh, they're so ugly, too. Oh, look at their face. Ugh. Okay. What do here? Pick up something? Oh, a rock. God, we better not run out of weapons again. This one might break. Oi! You're gonna come- okay, well at least in here you can't get on the ceiling, right? You run right into this. There you go, there you go. Oh, ow! Ow, ow. There's a first aid kit in there. What's it doing? Oh my god, it did get on the ceiling. What am I doing? I can't see. Alright, let's not go over there in that entryway. No, oh, it's about to break. I like that. He's on my booty! Come here. I shouldn't have done this. I'm going back inside. Anything else in here? Oh! Ay, ay, ay. I like being able to smash the glass. That's pretty cool. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Where are you gonna go, bud? It's just me and you. Run into this. Youch, they're so strong. Those arms. <gasps> that dummy scared me over there. Alright. You gotta be close, right? Ow. Get out, get out, get out! How did I know you were gonna do a cheap shot? Oh my god, oh my god, come on. Look, he's scared. He is scared of my prowess. <laughs> if any. Run into this. Oh. Are we broken now? Alright, we have to find. Here we go. Alright, let's go back in. This is the sweet spot right here. We draw him out here. Alright, he's gotta be close. Longest fight ever. There you go.
find a way out of here. What a bop this is playing. This must be from this OST, right? I don't recognize it. Alright, this should work, right? No, we need an axe. I do not appreciate these at all. Phew. Glad all that's over. This looks really creepy though, not gonna lie. Okay, I'm looking for an axe or a pickaxe of some kind. I know this is where I came from, but I'm curious if I might have missed one laying around. I don't think so. I went all the way back there to check. Uh, I don't think so. So, there's got to be one around here somewhere. Ah! I came down here to look, but looks like there's some... something going on over here. Explosives? Can I climb? Not. Alright, let's follow this wire then. Oh, it's going straight to the room that I need. Oh, maybe? <gasps> yes! Finally! I had to turn over this room a couple of times and I finally found it. Okay. Now, break through the barrier and looks like we're gonna set off a bomb. Here we go. Let's do it! Come on, you all know you want to do this at least once. And out comes monsters with it, huh? I already know. There it is, you see that sucker? Look at it. I don't even want to deal with it to be quite honest with you all. Look at him waiting on me. Mm-hmm. Waiting on me right there. <laughs> awesome. Now I can't go get it, but I think I have the weapon here. There we go. Hey, you know what? Take this rock first. <laughs> Alright, give me another. Let's go. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, any other rocks? Aha! We could do this all day! Ready? <laughs> That's so funny. Alright, what can I do without having to go over there? Maybe there's another rock back here. Uh, maybe here. I think I see it. Check it out. Nice. <laughs> uh, okay. One more, one more. Oh look, I think I saw one right there too. Sound effect is- the sound effect is everything. All right, I gotta get my weapon over there, so if you want to jump back up there. Ah! <laughs> All right, now it's fun. Get! Ah! No! Don't huff your chest at me. It's glitched in the wall! <laughs> both of them, both of them are glitched in the wall. I can't go forward without it. Move, sucker. Ouch. Oh, shoot. Wasn't expecting this. 
I can only get rocks. Oh, I missed. Okay, okay, come on, come on, come on. Grab it, grab it, grab it. No! This is awesome. I just really wish I could get my weapon. I got it down now. Right, any more? Any more? Okay. All right. Yes. Uh, give me that rock. Give me that rock again. Oh yeah. Uh, but yeah, the classic kick. Oh, okay. Can I get my freaking pickaxe, please? Don't do this to me. All right, all right. What can we do to? We need to cause like some sort of collision or something. Let's see if we can move it or something. All right, aim. No, no, no. Throw it. Throw it. Oh, see, see? That could work. That could work. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, let's keep trying. Let's keep trying. Yes! Oh! Okay, I do some cool things, see? Some cool things. I knew it! Gamer Pro Strats, everybody. Well, I can't speak for the first, like, 20 minutes of the video, though. That was atrocious. Uh-oh. I can't turn- Never let go of it. One day you'll see that it's all come together. You'll look back and laugh at what's past and you'll ask yourself, how the hell did I get through all that? Hmm. Like a mentor, or maybe his father's voice? That was the same voice that told me to run when the red light came, right? Ooh, you scare me so much! I do not like you! Dude, you can't hit me four times. There you go. No. No. Dude, these things are menaces. Come on. Come on. There you go. Oh my god, there's a body here. Dude. Mountains of Majesty by Daniel Eng English 3A Jutting underneath cer Cerulean sky Are rocky cliffs where my heart lies Eyes twinkling with emeralds fair My darling left me weeping there But her shadow can't take away These bronze cliffs at the end of the day Ooh Interesting Poor fella, who did this? Alright, should we pick this up? Ah, maybe we should. I feel like my pickaxe is about to bite the dust. Maybe there's something else? Ah. There's only wood, I see. This must be the train Seder told me about. Finally! We've made it! Thank y'all for sticking it out through that one. It was dark in there, hard to fight and see. The Devil's Train. Jokingly called the Devil's Train by the miners that once worked in the Devil's Pit, this mine train has since been converted into a ride for visitors. Equipped with a fascinating audio commentary, the Devil's Train provides passengers with an in-depth educational tour of the Devil's Pit. 
including an interactive reenactment of much of the pit's rich history. Please be advised that the tour includes the use of strobe lighting, so passengers sensitive to such effects should take extra care. Also, please keep your hands inside the car at all times. Uh, la 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 la. Refrain from using any flash photography. This sounds awesome. Let's get this powered on. Uh. Oh. Let's, I guess I have to do it in order. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like in a particular order. Hey, it should have been A. What are you talking about? What's the strategy? What is the strategy? Did I miss a note somewhere? Hey, the poem! The poem. Here we go. There's another piano puzzle. Silent Home 1. Jutting underneath Sterling. I guess that would be C then. C. A. E. Uh, D. B. B? I mean, I'm going in progression of the words. Which word has the letter... One of the letters first. So... C. A. E. D. Come on, this is right. Look, jutting underneath, cerulean sky, C. R, rocky cliffs, where my heart lies, A. Eyes twinkling, emerald fair, E. My darling, D. But, her shadow, B. These bronze cliffs, B. That's my thought process. Um... Unless the second line is C for cliffs, rocky cliffs. So let's try that. C, A, C. This won't work. E, D. <sighs> Hold on. Let me try something else. E, D. Hmm. Well, we got the first four right, don't we? But her shadow can't take away these bronze cliffs. Hmm. Okay, then let's try C. A, C, E, D, uh, mm. hold on, let me try something else, let me try something else, E, D, C, A, it's the fourth one that doesn't work, okay. C A E, dude, it has to be D right here. But all right, we'll we'll keep going. Let's just say B. Hmm. Then I'll say C. Then a B. Fourth line has ha has to be D. It has to be. Now the last one could be B or C, and then the fifth line, but her shadow could be B or C possibly as well. Oh, but also A. Cerulean Cliffs. Okay. Let me try again. I definitely think it's C first. A next. I think it's definitely... Oh, alright, then I guess I'm wrong. So let's try C, C. E. Actually, I don't think that'll work. Let me just try to reset it. 
Okay, reset. C. A. It's not E. I don't know why it wouldn't be. Wait, what? I thought I just did that and it didn't work. That's something going crazy. Oh. C. A. E. Okay, so it's not D then. D is definite though. I feel confident. Because it says my darling. I think that was the fourth line anyway. Uh, so, okay. Well then, fine. I guess we try something else. <gasps> Dude, the last one was C, and there was no fifth. There, are, er, there was no sixth. There was only five. E wasn't highlighted at all. That was completely brute force. I think I was just missing something in the poem. So, okay, if it, it was missing one, there's six lines here. So it was missing the sixth. I was thinking that we were going to use it, like E, like they all needed to be highlighted. But I only needed to input five. So for whatever reason, one of these lines didn't matter. And God, I even hope that we're supposed to correlate this poem with this. Uh, how funny would that be? If I sat there and tried to correlate with the poem on this and that wasn't even what was needed. I just needed to try to come up with whatever series um, by memory, whatever was correct. Kind of like that that puzzle in RE2 Remake where you have to click in, in a certain order. You have to remember and then it opens like a little lockbox. I have no idea. How funny would that be though if I didn't even need to do that? Like, if it was somewhere else, I, I don't know. I, I really hope that that was how I was supposed to correlate solving that puzzle, but if if not, then, um... Hee hee. We should be in the front, Murphy! With stops at Hillside Station and the Superstition Caverns. Ooh, Please, buckle up, everybody. Find the train at all times and remain seated until the train comes to a full and complete stop. This is pretty cool. Failing to comply with safety regulations can result in severe injury or death. Enjoy your ride and please. No Holy pressure. crap! It's a water ride too? Before it became the charming resort town that we know and love today, Simon Hill was once the center of trade and commerce thanks uh -oh. to its rich scenes of coal and oh, no. ore. You are riding aboard a fully restored mine train, originally owned and operated by the Gillespie. Ah, see their models. Which first began extracting ore from the Devil's Pit in 1860. This subterranean railroad was built in order to haul men and equipment to the firm 1200 meters below the surface, making it the deepest coal mine of its day. Long before the discovery of the pit, uh -oh. the labyrinth of limestone caves and mines were used by the local indigenous tribes for religious terror. Oh According no. In 1911, Sorry for some of the raindrops. I was wiggling the heck out of that. Oh my god, dude. I was fighting for my life with that analog stick. Y'all don't understand. Alright, here it comes. I'm gonna go crazy with it. I'm gonna go crazy with this. Ready? Left, right, left, right. Dude. Come on. Finally! Dude, I had to go crazy with it. Uh oh, we are definitely moving into. Oh, shoot! 
Get me out of here! <laughs> Oh, something tells me we're not back in Silent Hill anymore. We're somewhere else. <gasps> Whoa! Holy crap! That was terrifying. Did you enjoy the ride, Murphy? Okay. Oh my gosh, that was a trip. Oh, are we back at the start? No, we gotta be somewhere new, right? Pendleton! Oh god, girl, you scared me. I thought you were a ghost. But... I saw you! Hands against the wall. I said, Whatever you... up against the wall! Okay. You don't have to Whatever do Whatever you this. say. We should help each other at this place. I... I don't know what it is or how we got here. Enough. The one thing I just shut up. What the? Where did you get this? Where in the hell did you get this? She recognizes it. I just found it in these clothes. I didn't. Is this some kind of sick joke to you? No, I, I swear. I don't know what's going on any more than you do. Hmm. On your knees. What? Sit on your fing knees. Ooh. Okay, girl. Yes, ma'am. So she, it has significance you to her. bastard. You don't deserve to live. You're not fit to walk this earth while good, Wait. decent men. I don't know who you think I am or what you think I've done. Shut the hell up! You think this is funny, don't you? Well, let's see how funny it is with a fucking bullet in your head. Uh, excuse me. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't do it. Never had to, girl. She talking about killing Murphy? Go. What the hell are you waiting for? Leave me alone, god damn it! Okay, girl, cool. I will go. Hmm. I'm sorry. Maybe it was like her partner's badge or something. We couldn't see anything else on it, like where it was from. We couldn't see. Yeah, we couldn't see where where it was from. So maybe it's from like her own department. Maybe it's a partner. That's just a guess, though. No idea. I mean, it clearly has significance to her. Alright, what do we got? Another wood piece? Love it. Dead end. Devil's Pit. Oh. What? Oh, the electricity's on. Don't walk. Ah. Hey! I thought I just couldn't. Yeah. Maybe we turn this off? For the time being? Okay. I love the sound effect for that door opening. I feel like I've heard that used a lot. Some sounds just strike nostalgia, do you know what I mean? Oh, let's see here. Oh, 
Hello? Wait, that didn't sound good at all. Another friend? Why do I keep missing the jump scares? Where is that noise coming from? Hey, that's me. That goes out to me. Where's that radio? Hmm. Radio. What's going on with that radio? There it is. It's kind of folk. It is, really. Hmm. Hey, there's something there. Right? What is that? Oh, it's nothing. It's just like an asset, I guess. Escape from Silent Hill. I'm glad that's all over. Those caves just had me thrown for a loop. The dark areas, the really narrow passageways, walkways. The only time that the fighting was actually enjoyable was when we were in the big wide open part before we did the explosives. That was nice. That was fun. Especially because we could throw rocks at those ceiling climbers. That was amazing. But whew, thanks for sticking it out through that one, y'all. That was... Ugh, I had to warm up too. I haven't played this in a few days. No, no rock. Give me back my candle le bra. What's that? Oh, it's it's the reflection. Oh, I thought I could break it. Hmm. <gasps> Ooh. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This is this is the elite weapon right here. <gasps> An axe though, wait. Uh also great and especially useful to get through doors. And I wish you could at least stow one. That would be awesome. Hey. Oh, who breathed? Oh, it was just me. <laughs> uh hmm. Have we received a code anywhere? Mysteries. Maybe it has to do with the houses. How do I turn pages? I, I have more than this. I, I'm not sure how to get to it anymore, but... I don't think it would be the poem again, actually. But perhaps... Those room numbers... Oh, which y'all told me! That that was actually a peeping Tom! That is so creepy. No wonder he was being all pervy with it. Making note of like what they were wearing. Okay, so it's not optional. We have to find a way to get through it. Let's see if there's anything else in here. Oh, we can just go through. JK. How many digits? I guess it can be as many as you want. Oh my gosh, it doesn't actually... Hmm. Noted. We will have to remember that is there. Where is everybody? Thank God we're out of that pit, though. My gosh. I'm just searching the perimeter before I keep going. Oh, we get to start exploring some houses. Got a rake here. Mailbox. I think it's certainly worth it for me to check everything. Bottles. Just making sure there's not like a first aid kit laying around somewhere. If we know Silent Hill like we do, that's their favorite. Alright, so far I've run into bottles, a wood plank. Ooh. Yeah, the FPS kind of chugs a bit when we go into new areas. Let's see, sorry about that. 
Oh, someone had commented that, and then I couldn't find the comment. Jeez, you scared me. What was that noise? Okay, this shovel. Was that a shovel? I think it was. Well, this sucks. Or, yeah, I think it was. God, I hate these so much. I do your little screen. I'm gonna grab this. Ow! Oh my god. Yikes! <laughs> Finally! I like the boom when you kill him. I'm injured. I don't have any health kits. Just some bottles here. Surely we will find some. Also, this just was a big loop. Alright, yeah, I'll take that. Metal pole, let's go. And this? Oh, these are like bricks. I'm gonna throw them out and open. In case I need to use them. Okay, this didn't route around. This is a whole new... Whole new area. Ah. Shovel. I want my pipe back. Where did it go? Dang it, I couldn't find it. That's the only negative so far I'm running into. It's just the unfortunate thing. If you throw something in a bush or an asset, then it's lost forever. And unless you can see it, then you could maybe knock it. But I don't even see my steel pipe anymore. I'm just going to keep... Um... Nah, I'll do this. Look, it's raining and I'm getting wet. There's the other brick. Anything back here? Oh! I hear a police car siren. Wham! Hey! I hear you over here. Holy crap, this is cool. There's so much to do. Or to explore, rather. Bottles. Pick up what? Oh. Nah. Give me back my pitchfork. More bottles. Hey! What's that I see? Ah, oh, it's a brick. Dang it. Hmm. Okay, now this is the front. Okay. And that's just a bottle. I already checked up here. Oh! Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. Lamp. It's me and you, Lamp. Uh-oh. I know what that is. Where did they spawn in? I've got a lamp. And I'm not afraid to use it. Alright, we gotta figure out where to go. Ah! No! Ah! This is where I came from. It's so weird, it, like, there's like a flashing purple light when they spawn in. I think I can hide from him. Oh, oh my god, it's a dude! No, go through! 
Yeah, 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 go, go, go. Whew, give him the slip. Oh my gosh, that was creepy. Candles. Some more bottles. Oh, ooh! First aid kit! Crap, I walked right into her range. Now I'm getting... I'm out. I'm out of here, I'm out of here. Happy I found that. Alright, alright. This is back where we were again. Hmm. Oh, I should check the mapperoni. Wish we could take that fire extinguisher. Oh. oh! Flashlight! How do you turn it on? There we go. Nice! Okay, hmm. Let me check the map, because clearly I'm lost. I don't think I've come out to this little grove area yet. It's nice. Oh, and looky here. Okay. Again. What? What? Where are they? Nope, we don't go inside. And we don't open this, do we? Oh, I'm out of here. Nope. Not dealing with three. Let's go. Let's go. I'm hearing that siren. Okay. We're on the other side of the fence. Now what? Here's that back garage alley. Go to here. Oh my god, they're so creepy. Okay. And this is where I was throwing my bricks and everything. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna check my map in just a moment. Hey look, it's another candelabra. Okay, I think I'm... Oh. Oh, check this out. This is cool. Alright, let me check for sure now. Now that I feel relatively... Oh, I don't have a map of this area. Hmm. Alright. It's just me and y'all. And this fire extinguisher. I guess I should heal. I want the sledgehammer, but I've got a fire extinguisher. I feel like this thing could do some some good bonkin' damage. Bottles. Uh-oh. They saw me. Oh, they're so creepy. Some bottles here. No! Maybe drop my weapon! Oh my gosh. I am so out of here. I want to go more inland into the street more, but I'm just searching for any items along this path. It's a brick. 
Don't need that. Sledgehammer. Oh, sheesh. I like the little nos that you pick up when the enemy's close. Alright, uh, this is where I came from. Yep. There's my lamp. You are so scary. Holy... I just want to kill you because I don't like you. Ah! I'm pushing. Oh my god, did you see that little glitch that he did? Hey, looks like I have something in my hand again. <gasps> Kicked me. It's not very nice. Don't kick me. I missed it. Ready? This. <laughs> Take that. Oh, no. We exchanged. There we go. There we go. Dude, so creepy. Look at his face. What's his chest say? I thought it said heist. Okay, whew, I'm beat up again. Love that for myself. Now, I accidentally backtracked. And I don't have a map of this area, so it's not like it's making it any easier. Let's look at the streets. A cannon. Uh, what's this say? Silent Hill Police Department. Ah, uh, we can't go in? Bummer. Well, at least we're in a new area. Or at least across the street. I see, we already looked through all this. There's the chair, the sledgehammer. There were some bottles right there. We came through here. Ah, I want to check back here. We were kind of running for our lives. Yeah, check out. What's there? Oh, it's just a brick. Okay. Let's see what's. Oh! It's a blue bird! Open? Huh. I mean, should we? Poor little guy. Oh, it was so pretty. Ooh, memories? Oh. Set all the birds free! Are there any other birds around? Are there any other birds around? Cool. Your shovel. Ooh. You say. And I haven't seen one other bird. Maybe they'll be up in areas like this on the porches. Jesus, that scares me every time. Oh! What? What the heck is this? Find the police patrol dispatch, are you kidding me? You all are cognizant and aware enough to have police dispatch? What? So I can't stay on the streets. Oh my god, they have freaking intelligence. You know what? Oh. 
Okay. Dude! I'm out of here. I'm not dealing with that smoke. No, she caught me. What the heck, man? A silent Hillian monster patrol car. I'm just looking for birds, okay? Not looking for any trouble. Are y'all still chasing me? My god. Should I kill them? At least we can hit them. Come here. Uh huh. That hurt, didn't it? Oh, shoot. Oh, you're different. You must be the one I need to kill. Ow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now I'm vulnerable. Got it. Got it. And now you? Take that. And take that. <laughs> I love the bonk sounds. Yeah, I know what I'm doing now. Now I know. Bring it. Uh, where- I can't get it. I can't get it. It's in the way. It's in the way! <laughs> alright, alright, come here. Oh wait, don't use it, don't use it. Just- just squash him. Hit him with the- the- Can I drop it? I guess not. Alright, fine, that works. Phew! Okay, so you can't go into any of these homes. There's five birds, it said? Yeah, it doesn't even show me any details about where I am. Dang it, so we gotta find a map. Huh. Alright, that was probably my last... Yep. That was my last first aid kit. I haven't found but one of those birds. And I mean, y'all have seen, we've turned this place upside down. I mean, unless they're like really hiding them like behind trees like this. Oh see, I hear it. We gotta hide, we gotta hide. I hear it. That is so creepy. I don't know if I- I don't know how I feel about the concept yet. But the concept of hearing it and knowing you need to hide is pretty creepy in itself. Alright, I think they went that way, so... I'm back up through here. I just want to make sure... This seems like an area where we would find it. Hmm. Oh, come on, dude! I don't want to deal with this. Do it! How many of these suckers do I have to kill? Ha! Huh. No, this is where we started. Is there a map in here? No map around here. Whatever is in here is gonna be really helpful, I imagine. 
Someone abandoned their bird. Poor thing will die in there without anyone to feed it, so I set it free. Felt good. I know how he feels. So we have four more to go. It just says we need to escape from Silent Hill and find the birds. Uh, we gotta find this code. Alright, I came back here looking for a map. No map. But, uh, let's just turn this place upside down again. Any birds? Definitely a flashlight. I guess I'll pick up another one. Love the pickup sound. Go through here. Oh. Oh yeah, right here. Hmm. There was no birds down in that alleyway where the garages are. No birds out there where we came from, or a map. Can't go that way. Can't go into the houses. So I think we just connect to the other side of that gate. Which is where I was kicking one of those monsters rear ends for a long time. That's actually where I found the extinguisher. And this way too. Dude, the monsters ride a freaking police car. Missing child, Charlie Pendleton. Oh, that's my last name. Local missing child last seen at Robbins Elementary School. That's my kid. You dig? Oops. I'm out of here. Alright, well we're in a new area at least. Sheesh. For the love of all that is holy- ooh. Crap. He's got me bottlenecked. Oh my god, both of them. Ew! Get off, get off, get off. Oh, come on. I need to get back there. There's a really good axe. Uh, right here, right here. Okay. Uh, now let's go back here and left. Right here? Oh, come on, dude. What about back here? Alright, that's where the shovel. Okay, so I came from that way, so we need to go this way. Campbell Street. And that's the police station. I think. Uh oh. Uh, yeah, it, it, it is. It's really close by. Look at you over here. Well, I guess we just keep going up. Oh, this is all new. First time I'm seeing this. Hey, a crowbar. Oh! Dude! What did he do? Alright, I might run. I'm just gonna get my axe. Later.
take that. Uh huh. Alright. Let me explore. Explore this in peace. Alright, what's back here? Surely one of our birdies. Right? Yeah, this is all new. Dang it, that blue candle faked me out. I heard a bush. Hey, it's a fire poker. Probably not as good as this. Dude, no way you're gonna bring me to a dead end back here. Hmm. Just a couple of items, that's it. Dang it, I really thought we would find something. Oh, come on, dude. Go into here? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think I've been here yet. God forbid if I've been supposed to be... Dude. Go, 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 go. Alright, so I'm noticing I can't open new doorways. And I tried knocking down those boarded up doors here, but I don't think I'm supposed to. Yeah. Alright, let's exit. Be going down the street. Aha! Finally! Open that. Alright, before we go down there. Ah, oh, but I think that's it. Finally! Ah, I see, I see. I see where we are now. Okay, this is definitely it. Let's go. And I got the axe. Thank the lord. Thanks for sticking it out through that, y'all. It's been perilous. Oh, I can pick up the art. Awesome. Uh, I'm gonna keep my axe, though. I rather enjoy it. I can hear the cop car out there. No, please, I don't want it. So, these must be manifestations of Murphy's mind. Because of all the... I, I think that might be a son. The picture. Not like a brother. Oh my god, are we traversing the mist? Ooh. Stop with the chain noises. It's kind of freaking me out. Stop it! I feel like I'm being chased. Crap. Oh my god, there's something gonna be down here. This isn't where I came from, is it? Pearl Creek. Okay, I think that's the way to go, but one sec. We gotta make sure we check for items. Look 
that soap. All right, this is it. Finally. Sheesh. I'm so happy I could just kiss you all. Oh man, it's locked. What? No. Hmm. Maybe we missed a key somewhere. That would be unfortunate. I hope not. We searched pretty thoroughly. Let's just head back. Hmm. Let's pick this up. I just want to see. Oh, we collected it! I thought it was a weapon. Painting. Sunrise. Hmm. I wonder what we do with that. We wouldn't do it, do anything with it through this way. Because those are just locked doorways. Right? Yeah, there's nothing we could have used down there. Sorry for frame drops. Hmm. Can't even inspect it. Okay, we have a sunrise painting. We can't get through Hillside or Chastain Manor. What was it? Chastain Street or Manor? Both are behind locked doors. Oh my gosh, you scared me. No. Where would we use this painting? Oh hey, I didn't see this before. Oh cool. That is really far down. Come on. You got it. These must be the police call signs. Ah, D seven five C four six eight five five one four eight or seven four eight or just forty eight. I got another flashlight. Oh, thank God! And a first aid kit. Sheesh. Nice. <laughs> And I'm going to pick up this fresh axe after I'm done. Boom, baby. Fresh axe. Okay. Uh, I suppose we've got to call this off. Um... I don't even know why. What's the correlation? B75C46? 855? Ah, I see. Okay. B75. The button's broken. Oh no. Didn't work. Let me see. Maybe it goes all in order. I wouldn't imagine that it does, though. No way it goes all together like that. 855. Five. Hmm. See, this is blinking red. 855B. Oh, that was weird. I wonder why it does that.
Maybe the... Okay. Maybe we're just supposed to figure out what it says underneath the ones that are smudged. Let's take a close look. The only thing I can make out is C466855, maybe 7. Mm, 6, 7, I don't think we're supposed to, to discern all that. Let's just wait. Uh, let me check this out. Oh, okay, okay. That sounded like the mailman, maybe. Oh, check it out. From the desk of Chief Ronald Doyle, Annual Felony Crime Sur Survey. Incident. 74 burglary? Larceny murder is out of the... Uh, Arson, violent crime, incident, incident six, four, fifty-three, six. Wow. That's scary. Okay, so maybe that correlates somehow with calling this in. Let me check my journal because it gives us a- oh, and I figured out how to turn the pages. Oh my god. Um, objectives. It just says escape from Silent Hill. Hmm. Oh, did you see that? Oh, sheesh. I saw something over there. That was creepy. Okay. So. Patrol schedule. And now, notes. I don't quite see anything that would correlate, though. Ooh! I got one. C-44466. There's a shadow. Did you see that? Look. It's not my shadow. Wait, wait, wait. Go back, go back. So I got one successfully, but that doesn't mean anything, right? Oh wait, so what I did was, I guessed what this letter was. Four, C4, 6, 6. So let's try eight five five seven. I got that one right. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, I'll take it. I will take it. I don't really know if I was supposed to choose that one or if that was the only one that works and I got it right. I'm not even really sure how it's going to help me. Hey. Awesome, we got another note. Hold on. Vehicle theft. Reporting Officer Sergeant Matthew Baker. February 26th. Case number MA... Mm, blah blah blah. At about 2240 hours on February 25th, suspect was observed by a number of witnesses. See Appendix A at 4050 Bromfield Road, forcibly entering a parked police cruiser. Suspect was then able to start the vehicle and depart the scene in a reckless manner, approaching surface street speeds as far in excess of the posted limits. 
At approximately 2244 hours, patrol officers in the area as well as air assets from the Sheriff's Department answered the stolen vehicle call from dispatch that they had pursuit of the suspect. At 2310 hours, suspect exited onto Interstate 94 southbound on the Route 5 off-ramp. The suspect continued southbound on Interstate 94 at excessive speeds and pursuing officers maintain a safe distance to reduce collateral risks to nearby civilians. At approximately 0820 hours on 226, the suspect crossed the state line into Ashfield and exited into onto surface streets. At that time, local officers cordoned, is that how you say it? cordoned off the area to civilian traffic and dispatch road spikes. Spikes disabled the stolen vehicle, bringing it to a complete stop by at approximately 0835 hours in Baker. I wonder if any of these numbers, um, maybe even that phone number, could be the lock box. How the hell did this get here? So he might recognize it. So that was him then, I guess. Interesting, interesting. How did I miss this here the whole time? Oh, I knew you were hiding over here. Ow. Come here. Okay, I'm not sure if I did that that car thing correctly, but... Oh, it's still alive. <laughs> Not anymore. This is where I found the first bird. And I have not found... another one since. Uh oh. I went to go hide. I wasn't sure. Hmm. Oh! Holy crap. Alright, so now we have these paintings. And we have a bunch of numbers. Let's go see if we can put them to use. Back where we came from. Where that locked locker is. Alright. I made it all the way back here to this locked locker. Uh, now, what I think it could be... It could be, I mean, I think it's a, a long... A six or more digit number. So I think it might be this badge number. What's six digits? It might be more than that. Uh, six six one four three seven. That's what I did, right? Six six one four. <laughs> Dang it. All right, it's definitely a six digit. 661437 did not work. All right, well, I'm at a loss then. Um, I was so feeling confident on that because that's the only bit of papers we've received lately. Well, anyway, that's still locked down there. Well, let's head back to that side of town and we already called off one of the cars. It said so. It said that we had called off one of the patrol cars. Oh, jeez. Don't scream. Oh. That was an unfair move. Okay. So... In calling off one of the patrol cars, 
I don't necessarily know what that means other than the fact that we successfully did it. But I don't know what that would entail. Like, how does that help us? Uh-oh. They saw me. Yep, there it is. Go. Ankles. Uh, how do I get back? I gotta remember the layout. I think it's this way? Anyway, so we have two paintings now. Dang it. Didn't know she was that close or otherwise. Why is she wearing camo, by the way? It's kind of funny. Okay, so this is where we called off our first police vehicle. Right here. I mean, maybe we do more, but I don't think so. Oh yeah, and then this- oh yeah, the- the radio said by the clock tower, by the station, right? A clock tower of some kind. So maybe that's what we do next. Let me try something. Dang D4? <clears throat> right? <clears throat> D1. 7-5. Oops. Uh, I'm gonna do it all. I'm gonna run them all down. Got it, it was D3. Okay, so I got two now. I got the first one, I got the second one. All right, so 8557 is my guess. Or it could be a letter. 855D. 855A. I think it needs a letter. B855? 855B? Maybe it's- oh, it's B! It's B557. So, B557? Yes! Okay. Next. Alright, so we know it's D. So I think it's D748. Uh, D... Seven, four, eight. That was wrong, right? Yeah. All right. Well, oh wait, it's not. It can't be D. Never mind. Then it, oh, it has to be A. Duh. Not D. Sorry. Pfft, long day. Okay. So it has to be A. Seven. Wait. What was it? Four eight. Oops. I can't see. Uh, that's what I think it is. I think it's A. Yeah, A748. A748. Alright, then it's gotta be A. Uh, sorry. A. Maybe not 7. Maybe 248. A. Um, 5. Or eight. A six or eight. Yeah, I did it. We did all of them. Okay, so I guess that just means no more cop cars. So now we should be a little safer on the streets, I guess. Okay, and then the radio said find somebody. 
buy a clock tower? God, I hope I'm remembering that right. Oh, come on. Whoa. It is really storming now. Holy crap, this is like terrestrial downpour. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. Hilarious. So, what now? Yeah, stop the patrol cars. Identify each patrol. Yeah, we got it all. Hmm. The only thing that's really kind of left is... Uh... The, the locked locker. Um, and finding this clock. I don't think it's back where we came from. I think it's... Oh, shoot! I think it's like back this way. You know where the, the train area is? Or, well, to me, it looks like a train station. The way that the staircase goes down. Um, here it is, here it is. Now I still don't know where the... I still don't know where that ta that clock is. God, I hope I'm... I hope I heard that right. Hey, I was out here exploring, trying to figure out where to go. And I found an endless supply of steel pipes. Nice. I'm gonna have to remember where this is. This is on... Lansdale Avenue. Got it. Alright, well, all I've been doing is running around. Trying to figure out where to go. Um... I am utterly lost as to what to do next. Aha. Let's just go down here. Uh, I think it's a decent start. Just to get down here and see if anything is triggered. Anything new. <sighs> Alright. I have... I have went down in here. Went down, checked, made sure those doors are locked, and indeed they are. I'm pretty sure I went through everything I could in all the backyards, all of the fenced areas, even that little back alleyway where the garage is. I found one birdcage. Um, there was a voice on the radio, and I, but I don't think I can get to that part yet. And I haven't found, found a map. So, since this episode has gone on for a little while, and I am utterly stumped, I am welcoming hints uh, to help me progress, because I actually don't know where to go. Um, yeah, I've, I've pretty much searched every little yard nook and cranny. I did the police car thing so that it makes us safer on the streets. I don't think I've missed a place. So yeah, any hints? Maybe where I missed a map? I even tried the locker code with whatever notes that I have available to me. But I don't think they're... I don't think I have it yet. So anyway, sorry for the abrupt ending with not really something cool to look forward to. Well, I guess, you know, progressing is always cool. But anyway... Any hints or tips would be so appreciated to help me progress. What am I missing? There has got to be an item laying around somewhere. But anyway, I still had so much fun. Thank you so much for watching this episode. And I can't wait to catch y'all on the next one. Ciao!